It's now time for Interactive. Remember, if you haven't done it yet, download the Sportsmax app from the Google Play or the App Store so you can watch a variety of live sporting action. And for our viewers here in Jamaica, this is your opportunity to win a trip for two to the Champions League final courtesy of Jossbet and Sportsmax. Make a bet of 1500 Jamaican dollars or more on any UCL game up to April 28 and you can be one of our lucky winners. As usual, I love it when you send us your voice notes via WhatsApp and be sure to check out our clips on X, Instagram and YouTube. Well, in an interview which we of course spoke about earlier today on the Let's Be Honest podcast that has been going viral, Aston Villa winger Leon Bailey announced he'll be taking a break from the Jamaica national team. Let's take some of your voice notes. Hello, Sports Max. Yeah. Leon Bailey, Craig Butler, Jamaica Football, not working. Not a good love affair. So, Leon Bailey, thanks, and we accept your resignation. Yeah, man. As a poor Jamaican, before God and all mankind, I pledge the love and loyalty of my heart, the wisdom and courage of my mind, the strength and vigor of my body. Yeah, man. Big up you, St. Bolt. Messy share room. Who you, man? National oh pledge. Oh my, so, so... I just want to state though that I can understand that grown men would not want to share hotel rooms. Um, so I can understand that. Hmm? No, but, but, but what the viewer said just now, Ricardo... Yeah, is responding that... to him by okay. saying, I can understand when Leon Bailey says that he does not want to share hotel rooms I, I can understand that but it doesn't give you the right to break the rules and not expect to be punished but as I said at the top of the show clearly there is more to be said on this issue and I wait on coach Heimerel Grimson I want to hear some more voice notes I want to know the sentiments of the people that of course love Jamaica football and Leon Bailey let's take another one uh, good evening sports Max Donovan here to I always know Leon Bailey is not a lover of Jamaica he's a great one of the greatest pretender they still carrying feelings so what them do to him in the um, in the past um, and you know should not hold Jamaica responsible for that the whole country yeah man because um, Jamaica coach try with him even when he was in poor farm to try with him and since as he get farm and do well and time being contract he have no time for Jamaica he's always like that he's a great pretender another one that's not in Leon Bailey's favor yeah and let me also say Mariah I understand that it happens so let's not pretend that it doesn't happen and that jamaica the reggae boy setup is the only place that players have to share hotel rooms but i'm saying i can understand if you don't necessarily want to yeah let's take another one to be from trinidad what he is saying let me interpret it i am too big to be disciplined I am foreign base, have a successful career, who gives you the right to discipline me. So I will not retire, I'm going to take a break until the World Cup, when I want that on my CV, so then I will come back. They should just pretend that he doesn't exist. So what we did is we just got responses from Jamaicans. Yeah. We got one from a Trini. None of them seems to be okay with what was said in that podcast. And that's what I said earlier. I feel that this interview will do more damage to Leon Bailey and his product than it will do um, to the Jamaica Football Federation. Uh, so, yeah, let's take this other one. Hi, Sports Max. This is Mike from New York. Hi. I think the coach doesn't realize that these players, they don't need the team. The team need them, so mm. he have to realize they they have huge egos. So he have to stroke their egos a bit um, to get them on the team. You know, he can't do without them. The team is nothing without these guys, these um, professionals. It's All a right. two-way street, my, my friend. If you're going to be part of the team, then you have to be prepared to act in the best interest of the team. And, that's all I'll say on that. What's the definition of team? Because, you know, one of the things we always say is 
when you're a part of a team, like I'm a part of this zone team, I can't just come on here and do as I please and then hope for the best and whatever happens to you and Lance happens. Like, we always think about each other. So it's, it's, it's just how it works. Team has a meaning. Let's take some reactions on X now, please. Um, FZ says, he didn't have to do, he didn't have to do this in such an unprofessional way. We have problems, but at least try and fix it internally and go through the right channels. Jezebel says, was he really improving our chances at anything? Shrimp Don says, Leon Bailey still Afi conduct himself better in the eyes of the public as the most popular baller currently if you represent Jamaica still. That adjusts me. If y'all look for create a better environment for growth and development, start with yourself. Set an example. Well said. Saying, saying it with my chest. He needs to take it down a touch. Come down off that high horse. Would still take him at Arsenal. <laughs> <laughs> Agreed. Anthony, good. It needs to happen to bring big changes. Caveman says, this is so sad. They need to do better and prioritize the team. He can also use his influence and make things better. Miss Chin, me aga talk my mind. Leon Bailey can go on where him a go. Make, make Jamaica play without him because it's not like him a do nothing when him a play anyways. Tara says, this guy moans too much. Either play with pride for your country or stay at home. All right, so Ricardo, you know, one of the tweets really stood out for me where somebody said, and I really believe this, there are certain people that have the gift and the opportunity to make a change or make an influence and make a place a better place. And Leon Bailey is one of those players that had that opportunity. And I feel like he missed it. You know, he addressed it in the interview as well because he said he no longer feels that he can make the change that is required in Jamaica's football. And I felt that that was a telling statement that at this moment, and maybe it is because he is hurt, because it is clear that we are seeing a very hurt individual, but he doesn't feel as if his presence can assist or his influence can assist to build the football to the level that he himself wants to see it. And I actually disagree. I think he can. I think he had everything to do it. By the way, what do you think the score is going to be tonight? Jamaica, USA? Hmm. I think USA will win. It's sad. But I really want, I really want Jamaica to win. Score? 2-1. Oh, All right. I'll go 3-1 USA. Okay, we have to go. Enjoy the match. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're probably looking